The world is changing fast. We are three families. What if your brain got hacked? Perhaps one of the biggest fears people have about the idea of implanting a computer in the brain is that their brain might get hacked. And that's a pretty legitimate fear. But let's be clear, it's not hacked in a way a computer can be hacked. So someone might influence your brain. But what if they could subtly influence your perception of an event? Uh, or even at a more basic level, your enjoyment of an experience. How many governments would love to be in control of your feeling of whether they're doing a good job or not? No way! Oh, that makes me feel gross. <laughs> well, I think it's a shocking idea. They're going to make you do stuff that you don't want to do. It's like rob a bank or something. Have you been watching too many science fiction films? No. <laughs> <laughs> That's like me saying to you, I've, uh, I've infiltrated your, throat, your thoughts, so you like mushrooms now. Don't do that. What if you were able to have all that information that was on your computer just straight into your brain, like without having to have... Why would I have a computer in my brain when I can have it on my desk? <laughs> <laughs> no! 